Hey, my name is Cyril. I'm a filmmaker. Um, today, I'm gonna go over a footage that I graded. Uh, a lot of uh, you guys on online were asking me, hey, uh, can you show how you created that footage, etc." So I was thinking, you know, I'm gonna try to show it, but uh, never thought I would be doing a video like this, actually. Um, yeah, so, uh, so uh, you know, the, the idea behind it is that if you can find value in this, then hopefully it will be useful and, uh, and you know, uh, hopefully that will help you uh, create your own footage. What we are using is uh, DaVinci Resolve 17 and the, the footage we are going to grade has been shot on the Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera 6K Pro. Um, so let's get into it. So I'm going to select which one. Okay, let's select this one. Uh, it's a shot of uh, an actor, a friend of mine. His name is Jesse. Uh, we have been working together for years. Um, you know, what, on my first movie, etc., etc. So anyway, that's Jesse. Um, so you know, um, as you can see, when uh, when we look at the footage, it's, it's pretty flat. It's uh, it's shot uh, black magic raw. And it's even um, grainy because the, the, the it was a very moody and low light footage. So um, so yeah. So so first thing we are gonna do is um, change the color space. So basically to kind of explain, because uh, the first time I heard that I was like, what the hell is this? So so basically you know it's the same idea of why you would shoot in. 4k or 6k or 8k when you actually going to deliver in 1080 is basically that the, the, you you go with something really big at first and you end up watching it in in a smaller format but the definition that you gain by doing that is is huge so same concept here so if you will when when you take the color space of a rec 709 uh it's like a triangle and, and you evolve in that small triangle so meaning that at the end we're gonna be in a Rec 709, but uh, what we're gonna the color space that we're gonna use to color uh, is gonna be Da Vinci white gamut. So the, the the idea is that the the Da Vinci white gamut color space it's much wider than the Rec 709. So you're gonna be able to push your footage a lot more than if you were staying in a Rec 709 uh, color space. I hope I didn't lose you. I hope it makes sense. So now let's see, how do we do that? So you're gonna click on that little button, the, the little dial on the lower uh, right side. And then you're gonna see the, the setting appearing. So what you wanna do is click on color management and it will start by DaVinci Y RGB. So we wanna change that and you're gonna put it towards DaVinci Y RGB color managed. All right. And then um, instead of Rec 709 here, we're going to change to Da Vinci White Gamut. And so when you do that, so remember how the footage looked before, if you do that and boom, you know. So basically what, what it did is that it already converted it for you to a proper Rec 709, which is pretty amazing. So, you know, we could actually leave it like that and say, okay, I'm done. But of course, that's not what we're gonna do. And, and we're gonna take that as a base and, and go forward with it. 